I went to the dollar store for one thing. Hey y'all, it's your sassy gal and I'm here with a random Dollar Tree haul. Just wanted to show you a few things that I found at the Dollar Tree and literally I did just go in for one thing. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that how it always goes? You go in there for one thing and uh, you come out with a whole bunch of stuff because when you see it, you want to get it. And so the one thing that I went in for was shaving cream and actually it was for a craft. It has nothing to do with prepping at all. It was going to be for a craft, but I ended up finding this 12 ounce can um, for it's for a dollar. It's shaving foam. It's not gel or anything like that. And you know what? The ones that you buy at Walmart for a dollar are smaller than this. And so this is a better deal. So if you need shaving cream, go, to, you know, stock up on it, put it in your preps. <laughs> Don't want to run out of shaving cream. So anyway, um, I got three cans of this because I wasn't sure how much I was going to need for a craft. But anyway, it's it's a deal. And um, I don't know. I, why do I feel like I'm whispering like I we need to whisper? So I found something I have not been stocking up on is tissue, Kleenex, Scotties, whatever you want to call it. Things to wipe your nose with. Um, I have not been stocking up on this. I had just realized that when I was going through my stuff this last week. And I said, okay. I'm going to buy some tissues. And by the way, this is a big box of tissues. So um, I think this is a good deal for a dollar. Okay. It's not the little cube size. This is a full size box. So I thought that was a good deal. I got another uh, multi-pack of matches and let me show you what I'm doing. Okay. I, let me, let's do a little storage thing. I'm going to show you what I'm doing with all of my matches and things related to fire. So at the Dollar Tree or Dollar Store, look for um, shoebox size totes. They're not the sturdiest things, but um, you can use these to make um, modules or units or whatever you want to call them. And in my shoebox is where I'm keeping, like I was telling you, things related to fire. So I have, I keep a lot, lots of these matches in there. Okay. I also keep these things called Instafire Fire Starter. Okay. I found these at Walmart. Okay. So I'm keeping those in there. These are lamp wicks for hurricane lamps because I have lots of oil lamps around um, that I have just seemed to have inherited from family. So this is kind of what I've done in this box is I got several packages of matches. There's lighters in here. I have a big box of matches. Okay. These are the, um, the green light ones. These are wooden matches and lighters. I have several different kinds of lighters. And then I also have, it's called fancy heat. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Keeps your food warm, like at a buffet, these little things. Sterno. It's like Sterno. Now I'm not going to be able to get this back in there the way I had it. <laughs> But I'm putting all of these things related to fire in there. One thing I really liked about the Dollar Tree matches is that you get two, four, six, seven, you get you get ten of these all shrink wrapped together. And you know what? These can be like you want to give these to someone, use these to barter with, or give to someone that it might need a little bit of help. But I love these little fire starters, and I did just make a video about how to make your own fire starters at home. This is this fire starter stuff is good kindling. So, um, but anyway, that's what I've been doing, making these little modules um, to kind of keep things um, organized. And you know what? I'm not going to be able to get that stuff in there. So I'm going to have to, now that I took it apart, made a mess, I'm going to have to fix it. Okay. The next prepping item is instant coffee. There's six packets in these boxes for a dollar. Instant coffee. When you're in a pinch, this is what we'll do. Um, but I'm keeping these in the preps. Again, it's something that you can just throw in a bag, um, you know, to keep in a bug out bag, keep a couple packs in there. Or if it's something that you just want to give away to someone, again, another bartering item too. But these are a great deal. Six instant coffee packets for a dollar. And I don't know where I'm going to keep those either. <laughs> oh, I'm making more of a mess. And I am already having a hard time finding, uh, making space as y'all have been seeing. I still have shelves coming. So, um, then I got these full size dial hand soap. I think you can probably find these at Walmart for under a dollar still. I think they're like 97 cents still, but I'm not sure. I think they've gone up to just over a dollar. So this one is coconut water and mango. And this one does seem to be pretty popular at the Dollar Tree because there weren't very many there. So we picked up three. 
And then I picked up two more of the um, shelf milk, I call it, right? But um, this one's 2%. They didn't have any whole milk. And I'm sorry, 2% is the lowest I will go. I do like almond milk that they have there. They have those for a dollar a box as well, but it's only sweetened. And now that's, it's not bad. I want to try to go for unsweetened as much as I can. Um, but I also wanted something that I might be able to cook with. So I left the almond milk on the shelf and I put, got two more of these to add to um, my milk stash. <laughs> these are dollar store sh shower curtains. They are not the sturdiest thing. Okay. They are not tarp worthy at all however these can do in a pinch if you need to do um if you need like a, an instant ground cover um maybe a way to catch rainwater or something um i used them when my daughter and i went camping a couple weeks ago and there was a rainstorm coming and the firewood that we had had with us we put under a, the big pop-up um, the pop-up shelter that we had and we pulled all the firewood in there and then I covered it with a tarp to um, protect it when the big rainstorm came through um, and then of course it did you know it got ripped in a couple places and so I just threw it away it's a dollar so think of it as a disposable you know disposable liner disposable tarp I don't know a quick cover of something you know to maybe put underneath a blanket when you're on the ground or something. I don't know. Anyway, keep thinking of the ideas. I'm going to, I should do a video on like all the, all the things you can do with a shower curtain. So anyway, got a couple more of these to add to the stuff. Then, um, I was listening to another channel and y'all just cannot remember who it was, but they were talking about, um, shoelaces. So I picked up a package of athletic shoelaces. There are six pair of shoelaces in here okay there's white and black and then that's for a dollar you guys we got boot laces that was the other thing we picked up so that we could restring our boots if we needed and there's two different sizes in each one of these okay um and so there's um 72 inches and 54 inch okay and so there's those and so I picked up just a couple of those just something to get started I think no, actually, I did see more. Um, I thought I got the last ones in there, but there I, I was going down a little bit further and saw some more. So um, anyhow, Dollar Tree, a dollar for two pairs of boot laces and a dollar for the... This is a great deal, you guys. All right? Put these with your socks. Don't forget to be getting socks, too. Keep your feet happy. I got um, three packages of five hour emergency candles. There's six in each package. And so let me show you how, does it tell you how long they are? They're five inches, okay. Um, there you go. I might need to start a candle box. Um, but anyway, I got three packages of these and then I also picked up three of the tall Jesus candles. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just like, I have not seen now the ones I have been seeing coming in the Dollar Tree don't have any pictures on them anymore. It's just like a basic glass filled with wax. That's pretty much what you're getting. Um, so I have not seen any any of them decorated, which is fine. I don't really care about that. So those those are upstairs. I had already put those away in a cabinet. Um, and then these are going to go down here somewhere, maybe in my fire box. All right, so that's all of the stuff I got at the Dollar Tree today that is related to prepping. The rest was uh, a few small things for Christmas crafts and Christmas bags for um, for gifts. We got small. You guys, I got to show you this, okay? Let me show you these little bags. These are so cute, okay? Three. There's three for a dollar, okay? It's a little gift bag set, and they're small. They say um, the, the one side has all the um, glittery stuff on it, you know, says Noel let it snow peace and joy and we have these these are small and we're doing a lot of gift cards for Christmas this year and so this is going to be like some candy some tissue paper and a gift card here you go Merry Christmas okay <laughs> that was fun we also found some gift tags and some other faux snow and some of the little just a little few things but yeah you know I went in for the one thing and I ended up spending $45 <laughs> oh well that's just how it rolls because, you know, when you're seeing the prepping items, you want to get it while you see it. So, um, what are you seeing at your dollar stores? Do you still have stuff on the shelves or is your product uh, getting 
to be slim pickings where you're at. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you have any favorite items. Do you guys have your shoelaces? Did you guys remember these? Or how about tissues? What are some things that you guys are uh, not thinking of? Share them in the comments because we could all be helping each other out here. It's these little things that might mean a world of difference. When you have, you're trying to schlep through the woods or go for a long walk or a hike or something and your bootlace is, um, you know, you end up pulling and breaking your bootlaces that you're going to be in trouble. All right. So y'all stay stocked up. In fact, you know what I say at the end, y'all prep it up, pack it up and stack it up. Catch you next time.